you've been rolling pretty good here, Devin. What do you, what do you like most about maybe the, the way your guys' game has shifted over this last 10 years? I think the structure's been there, which is, which is good. Uh, special teams have improved. Um, and yeah, like just kind of it seems throughout the, all three periods that you know we're, t we're taking care of the puck a little better. It obviously hasn't been perfect, but uh, just, it's just been more consistent in my opinion. Do you like, I mean, the fact that the depth here was challenged a little bit with some injuries, and as, as one of those guys, like this, this group st stepped up pretty good. Yeah, yeah, the depth guys I think have done a great job. Um, it's exciting, right? Everyone, everyone wants to contribute, and, and when we're when we're fully healthy. Uh, <laughs> Some of the opportunities aren't there, which is which is fine, right? You're looking to do anything you can to, to help the team in any sort of capacity, and then when guys go down, you don't like to see it, but it's it's an it's an opportunity to, to step up and you know take on a challenge. So, and I think you know uh, the guys have done a great job at responding to that. What does it mean? Because the PK has been a little up and down. Like to have a five for five night like the other night, that's just as important as the power play getting the win. It's big, yeah, it's big. Um, Every, anyone who goes out there on that that PK, they're working their bags off, and they're they're trying to do all the right things. And we were just kind of leaking a, a lot, you know, at the start. And sometimes it's it's harder than you think to exactly pinpoint what's going on, and and that can creep into your to your to your brain, like as an individual and just as as a group. So um, you don't want it to, you don't want to do that. But I think we're all human, right? So when the pucks start keep going in, it's I, I think it's normal to be like, ah, oh, crap, like. Here we go, but uh, no, that was, we did a great job. Soupy was awesome, uh, especially on the PK, I thought, last uh, last game. And, yeah, it's great for the confidence. When Connor's killing penalties, and he's an offensive player, are you saying to Connor, well, he, he thinks the game like an offensive player on the other team, as opposed to, you know, yourself, you're throwing yourself around, and, and Connor's out there as a threat almost of, offensively, too. Yeah, you know, he, he's, al he's always a threat uh, offensively, um, and he's a smart player. I, like. Everyone up here is, is, a, is a smart player, and, and most of us is pro have probably been on the power play at some point, whether it's this league or, or a lower league. So you kind of know some certain tendencies, but special teams are always evolving, right? And that's why we do the video and why we do the, the scouting and stuff, because power plays are looking for different ways to, to beat you, and, and, and it's on the PKs to, to also be adaptive and, and proactive with that too. Has he been told he's not falling in front of too many shots? He's not diving in front of shots? like. I don't know. Like, like, like Nuge has been hurt a couple. Of times. Yeah, yeah. Right, right. Yeah. No, yeah. You got to be smart about it. Like, obviously, you don't want to lose Connor to a block shot. At the same time, there's there is a job to be done too. So I'm sure he's trying to f fill in lanes and making sure he sticks in the right spot and PKing with his legs, which are some of his best tools. Do you think he scares the other team on a power play when he's out there to kill a penalty? I think he scares the other team anytime he's on the ice, to be honest. But, but yeah, like there's, when a team's on the on the power play, they're thinking offense, right? And and Connor doesn't need much space to, to make you pay. So I don't know if they're, I think I think if the other team has a power play, they're worried about scoring, right? It's probably in the back of their mind, like hey, like if he's out there, let's let's uh, not let him burn us. But I think if you're worried about him scoring a shorty, but before they're worried about scoring a power play goal, you're thinking about the wrong thing. But. On a personal level, how nice has it been to, to be settled in on a line now with Kleem and with Derek that's kind of had some success lately? It's, it's great. Um, yeah, no problem. Um, rhythm's everything, I think, especially in the, in the bottom six. And, uh, and sometimes it's not there, and, and it's, out of, it's, it's nobody's fault, right? It's out of anybody's control, which is it's all good, and you just put your head yeah. down, keep yeah. working. But when you can get that rhythm, whether it's chemistry or just a, a general flow you know to your to your individual game and throughout the game it's it's big and yeah they've, those two have been awesome um they've been fun to play with and and uh yeah it's good